People are using their knives every time they cook, but they're not taking the time it takes to learn how to use them. I wanna make this clear right off the bat. This is not how to cut an onion video or how to slice a potato video. This is how to use a knife. Before learning how to actually use a knife, we must prep the cutting board. Place down a wet paper towel. On top of the wet paper towel, put your cutting board. This will make sure that your cutting board does not slide around. This is how to hold a knife. Take your two fingers, your thumb and your forefinger. You're gonna place it on the knife like this. And you're gonna take your other three fingers and wrap it around the knife. Do not hold your knife like this. Do not put your hand on the end of the handle. You will have no control over your knife and it could end up in your superior vinacava. Now, you might ask yourself, what do I do with my other hand? Well, I am here to show you. Do not place your hand like this because when you're chopping, you can easily go and chop your finger off. And next time when you're eating and your friend says a funny joke and you want to give them a thumbs up, well, you won't be able to do that any longer. This is called the claw method. You take your fingers and your middle finger usually will go out in front and you'll take your thumb and place it towards the back. So when you cut, it'll just go right along like this and make sure your fingernails are also tucked in just right like that. This is called the rocking method. Make sure to put your hands in the claw method. And with the rocking method, you're gonna take your knife and you're gonna rock it back and forth from the tip to the back of your knife. It looks like this in a rocking motion. And with your vegetable, it looks like this. And that is how you do the rocking method. The next method is just the straight up and down method. It is very self-explanatory. You're literally just gonna go straight up and down. And just like that, you have your chopped vegetable. Last but not least, this method is called the drag. And do not do this if you are a beginner. What you're gonna do is literally just take your knife and drag it and drag. And this is good when you have avocados or strawberries so you can fan them out. My preferred method is the rocking method where you just go to the tip and to the base and Make sure to go very slowly if you're just starting out. You do not need to go all Bobby Flango. You just need to take it and go nice and easy. And the more comfortable you get with it, the faster you will go. Thank you so much for watching this video. Go over here and click a video that YouTube recommends to you. Go ahead, click it. Click it right now.